Gabrazino with the Scoop News. It looks like the Herald has um, put in a FOIA request and I'll provide a link to the actual letter where they get some more information on the um, Sarasota County School uh, Security Opportunity. This is the plan that Sheriff and I put out in regards to having uh, prior previous uh, veterans and uh, marshals and um, police officers go out and work uh, at the schools a part-time basis and getting the training and all that stuff. But basically, the gist of it is, based upon this letter, which, again, I'll put the link right up here. You can see the letter directly. Um, they'll have to complete about 40 hours of instructions, about 12 hours of active shooter or assailant training, 16 hours of situational awareness out there so they know what they're doing. Um, they'll have to They'll have to go through some training for first aid, um, legal uh, liability training, and um, conduct a criminal justice professional service certification program. Uh, they wouldn't fall under the sheriff's department. They would be independent, and they wouldn't really have any um, authority as a sheriff. Um, basically, the human resources over at the school board, will their security team would do the hiring and all that stuff. They sheriff's office it appears would just provide most of the training to these individuals um, again without policing authority and their overall objective would be to be on campus um, with concealed carry in case anything happens uh, the one thing that would get in the way of uh, the sheriff's proposal is florida statute 790 which is about concealed weapons on school campuses you, you just can't do it um, the other thing, too, is the, the veterans. They have t been pushed off to the side, at least until the first uh, segment goes through. They would fo primarily fo focus on law enforcement individuals and giving them the um, priority. Uh, they would have to go through, like I said, a rigorous training and then a background check to ensure everything's in order. Um, so click the link above. That'll take you. Actually, I'll put two links. I'll put a link because... You know, it's a Herald story. They go into detail on it. So I'll put their link up there. Also, I'll put a link to the letter which details all this stuff out. This has been Frankie Abrazino with The Scoop.